Today I'm going to show you my way of triggering events through blocks. So a player will walk over an invisible block and an event triggers. I will show you how to do that. Let's do it right now. My name is Chu. Let's go. All right. Open up M Creator. Let's make a new block. Give it a name. All right. Now, we need to create a texture. And this is it. Save the texture block. Give it a name. There we go. Now use your texture. See how you can't see it? Just put the red square. You just made an invisible block. Make sure they're all in there. All right. And you want it to be able to, um, be able to walk through it. Oh yeah. Make the bounding box zero. Save. All right. Now you got the block, right? Good. It's, uh, all right, let's make the trigger. Go to triggers in the block settings. Now, here's the trigger right here, but let's remake this. Okay, go to procedure templates. Click on check if current NTD entity is player. Now, go on the search and type spawn. Get the world spawn at XYZ living entity. Let's make this a uh, rabbit. Why not? All right. Let's duplicate that. Why not? Let's put a bunch here. All right, now type remove in the search. It's the first one. Remove block. Save it. Now it needs to go in when entity collides in the block. Press save. And then you need to go to uh, end the block stand. Get, can walk through the block. Click, um, click, uh, click that. And also the block sound. I would make it metal so you can hear it when you put it down. And maybe give it a better name. But let's start with this invisible trig rabbits. All right, let's test this thing. I'm going to show you how this works. So you go in creative mode, you all scroll all the way down. It's, it's, it's the, uh, last block and the, uh, building blocks. It's invisible. Uh, you won't see it or you will see it or whatever. Uh, yeah, just put a stack there and then, um, just set one down and see. No, it shouldn't work again because it, it, it um, removed the block. So how I use this is how I use this is uh, so you want to use it in your uh, structure gen. So you make a mod and you got something structure generating randomly like a tree, a uh, house or whatever. I put these on choke points where I know the player is going to be at. Nice. Like at a doorway. Oops. There we go. Yep. And the player will walk through here. It'll trigger the event. 
and you can be real creative with this. Um, you can trigger explosions, particle effects, uh, all kinds of, you know, mobs, whatever you want. Let me see if I can find a... Alright, so you lay one of these down. There you have it. So now you can go do triggered events for your mod. Um, I hope you liked the video. I appreciate all the recent subs. And uh, have a good day.